When I start something, I do it full speed. And I always start uh, by digging, learning, trying to find the perfect information, trying to speak with the leaders, getting as much information as I can. And right now I have um, a new project coming and um, I will reveal on this channel in further episodes uh, what it is, but you'll get a sense with uh, this episode today. So today we look at a book that is um, that is recommended by a book recommended by Mr. Gutenberg. Cope with the distance. Business advices from a CEO on how to start your business from daily life events. Click like and subscribe to promote this video and channel. So Steve Gutenberg, uh, alias uh, the Audiophiliac on YouTube, recommended this book, Hi-Fi for Christmas. Look at it. Let's look at it now. So when I start a passion, I always dig for information, and and this is in that vein right now. I'm I'm considering uh, launching a project in Hi-Fi. And this is the perfect book. I saw that on the Audiophiliac uh, Christmas Review. Uh, Hi-Fi by uh, Gédéon Schwartz, on Fedon uh, Editor, the publisher. So let's open it and see how it is. I've seen some of part of it. It seems to be a lot of pictures of Hi-Fi gear, which is fine because uh, part of the fun of hi-fi is the, the pleasure of the equipment itself. Uh, so we'll see on this book uh, the history of equipment so it helps to understand the trends and where it's going afterwards. Um, Amazon delivered in 24 hours. I was very impressed. So let's open this. It's all black. Wow, Swiss design, highly appreciated all the time. It's very, very well put. So from 1950s to the 2000s. Okay, so there's some text, a little bit of history. I will read that with passion for sure. And then there's introductions of different equipments. Some radios with tubes, another section, 1960s, oh yeah, more design. <clears throat> Different sound system, the 1970s. Yeah, it's more industrial at this time. Nice, you can really see the equipment. And there's more text than I thought, which is awesome. Because there are going to be more information. Uh, the, the headphone stacks, that's cool. It's quite a revolution, these headphones, as I heard. Wow, very nice systems. That's my dream right now. Today, this is the sound system I would purchase with a uh, amp and sound Nautilus amp, tube amp. These uh, loudspeakers and subwoofers are extremely efficient. They can be powered by very low uh, wattage uh, amplifiers. Nice. So we continue, we continue, we continue. That's very nice. You're in the 2000s. Beautiful. I learn a lot. I'll probably learn more companies and more type of equipment. 
so I'll be more uh, savvy when I when I plan projects. Well, thank you, Steve Gutenberg, for this recommendation. I look forward to spend my Christmas time with this book. Um, if you have this book and uh, you want to comment on it, it'd be fantastic. So we can exchange ideas and uh, comments on it. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe anytime and uh, to comment. Uh, I really like that. I can't state um, too much how important is history in everything we do. Uh, history helps to understand trends, trends and opportunities. Uh, if you know how things evolve, uh, you can understand trends and set them. And the notion of momentum is essential in business. Um, and understanding the past gives you a good indication of the timing, of the speed of things. For instance, I started uh, to be on the internet, to go on the internet, there was 3% of women in the whole internet community. And I saw the trend grows of grow and other trends as well. And so I, I, I really feel the medium uh, because it's in my vein now. I've read everything I could on the internet uh, when it started and I, I, I've followed the evolution. Same goes with business and with music. So learning all, all the old audio equipment will, understand, will help me to understand where it's going and uh, be able to plan with it. If you want to comment on any hi-fi trend, I know nothing, so please inform me, please comment down below.